get this linkage going and check if it's actually live. Bum, bum, bum. What's going on here? Oh, look at that. It's actually working. Sorry, give me a moment. Oh, I should probably not be on that. Let me at least turn that volume off so we don't get feedback. That you look. Let's see. Guess I can open up comments somehow because half the time I can't see this stuff. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello. All right. Looks like something's working. So I'll get started here. I'm going to put on some random music um, in case my husband comes home because he works from home now. So he might be on conference calls and stuff. So I have to use royalty free music. So I apologize if it's boring. Start with. Well, I don't know if we need music yet. I'll wait. Anyway. So here's little froggy boy in here. He's, uh,. Based off of a African dwarf frog, actually. Um, could be a little baby toad if you want. Whatever. Fantasy. Could be whatever you want. Um, the only thing I'm not crazy about is this line of bubbles that I got in here. But, whatever. Still kind of cool. Um, learning process. First time trying this resin out. Um, definitely needs some kinks worked out. Could probably get it to work, but it was just really annoying to work with. But, still kind of cool. So I'm just going to finish him up. i got to put some, like, water disturbance in there because the water wouldn't be flat if he's moving around like that and seal up the leaves and him. And, yeah, because I had to paint this. Because this, when this came, I ordered it. It was a lot bigger than I thought it would be. <laughs> yes, this is the whole order, and it's, like, in neon green. So I had to kind of tone that down a bit. Um, I tried dyeing it in alcohol inks for a couple of days, and that did absolutely nothing, so, um, paint it was. I just gotta seal it in there now. But anyway, so I'm gonna use this stuff I had for, like, a very long time. Hopefully it still works. <laughs> um, Water Effects. It's a Woodland Scenics. It's usually for model railroads. It's, uh, kind of like a paste-ish stuff. That, oh, oh, God. There goes all my pens. Hang on. Because I'm trying to hold this tripod up. Um, it's like a paste. And it dries clear. So you can kind of like mold it a little bit. And it's also very difficult to get on the other side of him. So I'm going to try and use a syringe. Maybe some toothpicks to get up in there. I don't know. We'll see. Again, this whole thing is a... Uh, Trial and error type deal, like usually everything that I do. Um, what am I looking for? I think I just use a palette of some sort. Alright, so let's start with some disaster. I'm just gonna like get rid of this little piece here just in case. And give you some. Show you what it looks like. I probably shouldn't have drank that coffee. Very shaky. Alright. See, I can already not get in here. Just 
big bottle. So, start with that. Pray that this will actually work. I kind of need something thicker than a toothpick. I need the back of this, but I don't want that, because that's got stuff on it. Let's get a new one. Where's all my stuff? Uh, these are, um, usually they're called, like, airbrush dabbers, um, but they're actually also, um, eyelash glue something or another. I'll put a, links in the description later. I don't think, I, I can't really do that right now, um, but I'll try and put links to everything that I'm using here in the description. Uh, I don't know, somebody's messaging me. Sorry, I can't get back to you right now. <laughs> um, so, oh, I should be on the actual YouTube so I can see who's writing what. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Just make sure it's nothing about this. Oh, it's just about a clip. Okay. Yeah, so, okay. Uh, hopefully this chat's working. Alright, so. Just gonna try and push this around. Make it look like something. Like he's kind of splashing in the water here. Where's all the chunk of it? Not like that. Mm. I need a paper towel to wipe this on. Oh, I forgot I was cleaning my airbrush. and Now it's sitting in there. Dag net it. I almost forgot to take it out of there last night, too, before I went to bed. That's, how you, that's why you can't have nice things. I hope this stuff doesn't react with whatever this resin stuff is. Don't know if I like this quite so much. There we go. A dig. I dig. Alright, it's awfully really silent in here, so I'm just gonna put that musica on. Isn't that lovely? So. Okay, we're going to need some of his butt here. I'm not too worried about getting it on him because I'm going to gloss him anyway for the most part because he would be wet living in this little bowl. So you can have your own little feisty froggy pony or toady pony, whatever you want to call it. But again, um, I looked up the African dwarf frog and because that's the one that most people keep as pets in little terrariums like this. And I did the best I could to replicate that. Alright, now let's see how to get on the other side there. No. Um, pouring some on a palette here. Oh, this, I think these bend. Did these bend? Ooh, check it. Get in there real good. All right, all right. That's a start. Should I do it with that? No, that's just gonna take. Try my syringe here. Suck some of that up. Just to get the bulk of it in there. Oh, I'm so shaky from my coffee. Come 
Nah. I need something like this that bends. Mm, I don't got nothing like that. And that's not doing anything. This is actually like a really cool piece for like a work desk. Imagine like people coming over and be like, oh, what do you got in there? What the? All right. I think that's gonna work as good as it's gonna work. What the heck happened there? Oh. I keep forgetting to leave the chat open here. There we go. I don't think anyone's saying anything anyway. Wait, that says top chat. Live chat. Yeah, okay, I know. Yeah, it's a live chat. Thank you. I don't need to learn more. Whatever. So I don't want as much ripple on that side because he's kind of turning that way. Mm hmm. where the uh, animation background comes in a little handy with motion stuff like this. You gotta kind of figure out what the movement would have been. So my degree is not that useless, huh? Alright, so now that front foot's going to be pretty splashy because it's See if we can get it in. La, um, is there anyone here? Oh, there goes the musica. Let's do this one. Ah. Look at this, I'm like super shaky. It's from that coffee. I didn't eat much today and I had a nice coffee, like a dum-dum. And then I decided to do a little micro work. Mm-hmm. <coughs> Dust. Splash there. Yeah, I think I, I think I'm kind of liking that. So theoretically, that should dry clear. It usually does, but <laughs> I've had this stuff for a very long time, so I really do hope it's not gone bad or something and won't dry. But like I said, whatever. It's just for fun. I mean, it will be a sales piece. It's just kind of like a experimental on top of it. So I think I kind of like that. Do I need a little more on his other leg? Yeah, probably. Back here. Yeah, I dig it. I dig it. probably do some drips off these plants, but I don't think it would be that splashy, so I'm going to leave that alone. I think that's it for the splash. Now, I need to seal these thangs. I'm going to use Joe Sonia, because uh, it says it's non-yellowing. Um, I really like Joe Sonia. Uh, this is the gloss varnish. 
just on you. I'm gonna gloss him. Might gloss some down here, but as I get a little higher up, I'll probably just do regular um, all purpose, which is got like a satiny type finish. I thinned this one already, so it's gonna be thinner than it usually is if you buy the bottle yourself. <sighs> so overall, the amount of grief this guy gave me, it's coming out actually pretty cool. Brush. Disgusting, dirty brushes. Nice. Whatever. This will do. No, I don't want to do that. I don't really want it. I'm get a fresh one. Yeah, this is fine. I mean, he has been sealed already. It's just he hasn't been sealed in gloss and. I feel like he would be glossy. Living in the water. And I kind of want to do like a sort of uneven e gloss because he'd be, you know, splattered, basically. Oh, that's cool. I really like that. Cool beans, cool beans. Now, mm, how am I going to get on the other side? I'm going to have to get a brush and blend it. Oh, that music was over quickly. Again, I am going for splotchy glossy. I mean, he can be all glossy, but it can be thicker and thinner in some places, because, I mean, think about when you go in water, you're not one full wetness, if you will. And he's got his little branch he can stand on if he doesn't want to be in the water. Uh, what am I looking for? What did I just say I needed? A bendy brush. And to put on some more music. What's this one? Did we do this one yet? I think we did this. No, we didn't. All right. <clears throat> What can I bend? What can I bend? What do I care about? Uh, I don't know. Oh, here. This brush. This brush looks stupid, so we'll use this one. Are we going to break it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Alright. Look at me making my own stuff. Well, that worked really well. Get them all. Always where I wanted it. But. Okay. Gloss some of these things down here. Hmm. Probably use a regular brush for that one. Oh, who's stupid? I'm stupid. I bent the wrong brush. <laughs> I took out this crappy one because I didn't like it, and I bent the good one. <sighs> Whatever. I'm so done. Alright. At least it wasn't, like, a good, good one. Although I feel I would have realized that before I did it. Ah! And that's the wrong stuff. Oh my goodness. Stand up a little bit. Just 
print should probably be right down here. Around there. Couple little splashes on here. Maybe some splashes at the end here. Wish I didn't bend that brush. <laughs> Alright, so now this is going to be the all purpose. Let me pour some more because I poured it into the gloss. Oh my goodness, this is the gloss. a dull day around here. Alright, now we're just gonna seal this up. Might be a little glossier than I wanted, but it'll do. It'll do. It'll do, pig! It'll do! And yes, I quote that all the time. And this stuff should also dry clear. Kind of like Mod Podge, the all-purpose Joe Sonia. I just didn't want to mix brands when I'm putting them so close together. I don't really want to get that branch because I like how it looks natural. Get the uh, moss here. Alright, I think that'll do it. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Just gotta pick off all the stuff I got all over the edge. I'll fix that in a minute. Alright, so Froggy Boy should be done here. I don't I wasn't really gonna call him Froggy Boy, but it kinda stuck, so I guess that's his name. So there it is. Um Yeah, so we just gotta wait for this stuff to dry and uh then he'll get us final photos. And be for sale at some point. Probably not until the warmer months because I'm not shipping glass in the winter. Uh-uh. No way. But this is really cool to look at. Like, I didn't want it there. I did not want that line of bubbles there. This stuff was very difficult to work with. Um, but it's really cool to look at. So at least it's interesting. I like how it's like... I do like the bubbles by his butt there. It's cool. That's fun. I want to do more of these. It's cool. So, yep. Thanks for joining me, if you join me. Um, obviously, like, comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. Um, I'll put links in the description shortly. And, yeah. Bye! Now, how do we shut this thing off? Mm. I don't know how to shut this off. How do we stop? Ow. There's no, like, stop button. Where is it? Do I just hit the X? Are you sure you want to stop? Yes. Oh, there we go. Okay. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching.